The second race today is the International Hurdle. It's a two mile one foot on grade two. And all five year olds are up and at the top. We've got Dominion of Darkness for Joshua Southern, Schiller Park, Darren Thompson, Arlington Ballyman, Vinnie Gerard, Baltic Dragoon for Graham Clutterbuck, Fair Dinkum for Stu Gray, First Strike and Fondemort for David Hoodie, Gallant Toby, James Shake, Invara Windmill, Martin Leland, Age of Darkness for Paul Rose, China Girl, Alex Cherry, Dark Shadows, Leon Van Rensburg and Ozark Muse for Vinnie Gerard. So 13 of the men in this. And called in and away. Making their way towards the first flight then. It's Schiller Park for Darren Thompson who's going to be the first one to show. As they complete their run to the first of eight and they're all safely over that with the exception of China Girl who's gone. So China Girl a faller at the first end. Bit of a surprise there and that's the second race running where Alex Cherry's had a faller, so not a particularly good start to the week for Alex. Hopefully things will get better for him later on. And it's Arlington Ballyman who's in the lead then by about four or five lengths racing down towards the second with Fair Dinkum, a new car in second place. And in, in third on the inside is Ozark Muse and Schiller Park as they make their way past the big screen and over the flight that'll be the last next time round. And this time they are all safely over it with Arlington Ballyman setting the pace and leading by five. They'll probably cut across to the inside as they take this turn there to save a little bit of ground. And they race uphill towards flight number three with Arlington Ballyman clear by five lengths to Dark Shadows in second. Then Schiller Park is third, Baltic Dragoon on the inside fourth, then Fair Dinkum and Dominion of Darkness is on the outside of that one. Ozark Muse, stable companion to the leader. Then Fond Mort is after that one and then Angel of Darkness and Kinvara Windmill. And finally first strike and the one that's out of shot is Gallant Toby. So that one seems to be struggling at the back as they get over to third. And they're all safely over that third flight with Arlington Ballyman setting a strong pace then from Dark Shadows in second and Schiller Park third as they race past the water jump. They're still going slightly uphill when they get to the fourth. And they're all over that one with a mistake at the back though by first strike. Didn't jump that one at all well and he's now going to join Gallant Toby out of shot I would think with Arlington Ballyman over the fifth in the lead. Arlington Ballyman and over that one in front. Good jump from Dominion of Darkness. Saw that one take a share of second with Schiller Park on the inside. Dark Shadows is still going well. Then Ozark Muse, Baltic Dragoon after that one. And then Fair Dinkum, the newcomer, running a decent race in mid-division at the moment. Angel of Darkness in the yellow jacket on the outside. Then on the inside of that one is Fon Mort, Kinvara Windmill towards the back with First Strike and Gallant Toby is still somewhere out of shot. They're all over the sixth. They've only got two more flights to take. They're racing downhill now and Arlington Ballyman is in the lead but now only by two lengths to Dark Shadows in second. Schiller Park is third. Ozark Muse on the outside of Dominion of Darkness. Now the one coming round the outside. Angel of Darkness is coming through with a bit of a run. Baltic Dragoon after that one. And... Looking towards the back, Gallant Toby still nowhere to be seen as they come down towards the final two flights. Arlington Ballyman in the lead, but only by a neck. Dark Shadows is second. Baltic Dragoon on the inside. Then Ozark Muse on the outside of that one. Wider still. The yellow jacketed Angel of Darkness and coming even wider is Dominion of Darkness as they get over the, fight, the second last flight. They're all over that one safely now with Arlington Ballyman still in the lead. There's four furlongs to go and just one more flight to take. And Arlington Ballyman is back in the lead by two lengths to Dark Shadows in second. Second. Angels of Darkness is in third, then Baltic Dragoon, Ozark Muse, Dominion of Darkness after that one, Darkness all over the place as Arlington Ballyman continues to lead with three foot with a three length lead then and coming down towards the final two furlongs. Arlington Ballyman with one more to take is led all the way from Fonmort who's now come through in a second. Dark Shadows is third, Schiller Park is fourth, then Angel of Darkness in first strike, trying to get into it over the final flight they go. And Arlington Ballyman is now collared by Fonmort. Fonmort takes it up immediately, tackled there by Schiller Park and Dark Shadows. It's now going to be Schiller Park who goes into the lead. Schiller Park bursts into the lead and suddenly got a length clear. And it's Schiller Park who's going to pull away and take this one from Angel of Darkness in second. So Schiller Park wins it. Angel of Darkness is second. Bolton begins to come for third, then first drop. Von Mort dropped away. Kinvara will not finish well. Big gap back to Fair Dinkum and finally Gallant Toby, who did get round in his own time. The two newcomers pretty detached at the end, but Schiller Park takes it. For Darren Thompson. And Angel of Darkness second for Paul Road. So should have parked the winner then for Darren Thompson. Angel of Darkness, Paul Road second. Baltic Dragoon for Graham Clutterbuck was third. And David Hooley was fourth and fifth with first strike and Fondemort.